Hey guys, welcome to Atari Series 7, and I'm reviewing this, which is the Avengers Gamer vs. Captain America. So really cool, really blessed this came in the mail today. I'd ordered these a while back, and they came. And uh, as you can see, we have build a figure Joe fix it there. We have Gamer vs. We got a nice clear view of Cap and packaging. We have the Avengers logo, and then we have images from the game, as this is based on one of Captain America's suits, uh, the self suit, and then you can see him with the other alternate head. And then you have the other characters in the wave. Let's open this up. So, here we have Captain America out of packaging, and as you can see, he has this really cool black and silver type stealth suit. He gets an on-mast head, and you do get a mast head, which I will show later, and you get some alternate pairs of uh, hands, and he just looks really cool. And I'm going to be honest, I like this design for Captain America. A lot of people don't like this. They say it's like too SWAT or military looking, um, but I'm going to be honest, I feel like if Captain America was a real person that exists in the real world, I feel like he'd wear something like this. And as much as I love the movie suits, I don't really think they're entirely realistic to how they'd actually make Captain America look. So I kind of like this, to be honest. And I think this black and silver color scheme looks better. I mean, you have where the black here cuts in. Almost kind of makes it look like a black and silver American flag. Um, I love how the silver stars and these silver lines. Um, they actually took the American flags off the side of his uh, shoulder pads here, which I'm going to be honest, I kind of wish they were still there. This is the original figure, which had the American flags on each side, which I just thought was a cool little detail. I don't know if he has this in the game. To be honest, I haven't played the game yet, so that might be something from the game. Uh, but either way, it would have been cool. You also have these silver lines that go on his hands. These are kind of like a more metallic silver. And then there's also silver on his gloves here, which I think is pretty cool. They didn't paint anything on the gloves on the first figure, so I think that's cool. And then he does have fingerless gloves, and you do get an alternate hand, so he can kind of grip with this hand, and an alternate fisted hand as well. And then you get these knee pads, which are brown and silver. And then you have these brown boots, which have some nice treads on them. And then on the back, you do have a peg hole for the shoulder. And this is the shoulder. It's the exact same shoulder that we got with the first series. And it's pretty cool. I wish they had done a black and silver shield, but in the game, he might not have a black and silver shield, so that might be why they didn't. And uh, let's take a look at that head sculpt, because this is new. And I believe these are digital head sculpts. I think they said um, that they said these were going to be the first head sculpts that were digital for non-live action based characters. And I gotta say, it looks pretty good. It looks like Cap from the game, as I remember seeing him from the trailers. Uh, it's got some dark in the blonde, so it does look realistic, and I think it looks pretty cool looking, to be honest. I actually really like it. I kind of like this more than the mask head, and then here's a comparison with the mask head, or I'll just show you the mask head real quickly. As you can see, it's um, pretty good. It looks pretty good. Definitely looks like Cap. You have the A there, and it has the black and silver on it. But um, yeah, as you can see, it's got the silver and the black, and to compare it really quickly with the head sculpt, of the first Captain America. As you can see, there's a little bit of a darker wash on this one, almost like he needs to shave. There's just more of a clean shaven one. So I do like the head sculpt on here better. Um, it doesn't feel like it's actually fitting onto the head that well. Uh, the ball joint's kind of big and the head like hole seems kind of small, so that's weird. I might just put the on mast head on here because I like that better. Um, but you can look up and down. You got 360 at the head, you can swing out the shoulders, or ro free rotate, ah, rotation at the arms and swing out the shoulders. So you have a 360 there, double joint elbows. 360 of the wrist. He has the exact same articulation as the first Captain America, 360 torso and ab crunch, um, because the same figure, but still not too bad. And you know, he got 360 there, double jointed knees, 360 at the boots, and the feet move up and down and go side to side. So in terms of articulation, it's pretty good. We've seen it before, but I mean, if it's not broke, don't fix it. And um, yeah, I think it definitely works. So here we have Captain America over here. And then let's have a comparison with the first wave Captain America. I can get him over here in shot. And uh, as you can see, they look pretty good together. And ultimately, let's just turn his head so he looks more that way. I think it just comes down to whichever version of these you like. I mean, you know, this, even in Captain America's classic colors, this doesn't look much like we've seen Captain America before, but I still feel it's a really nice take on Captain America. I like the designs here. I kind of like the black and silver suit more, the, uh, the new stealth one. I think it just looks really good. And I feel like if you didn't like this first Captain America figure over here, whether it was the paint or the overall design, I feel like you'll like this black and silver one because it just looks really cool. And I feel the head's better on it. I like the idea of the on-mast head. And yeah, I think they're both really good, but I think this gotta be my new favorite. Though I I do still really like this one, and I wish they had kept the American flags. But yeah, thanks for watching. Please rate, like, and subscribe.